brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. In this video, I'm going to show you uh, an alternate way to um, tighten the harmonic balancer on this 2002 Toyota Tundra with the uh, 4.7 liter V8. Uh, this is this will apply for a lot of different Toyota and Lexus vehicles that use this engine. Okay, you can buy a tool that holds uh, the harmonic balancer, uh, but that tool generally costs between, I think, $80 and $120. And so here I'm going to show you how to do it with a basically a piece of 2x4 that's just a little over 2 feet long. Um, you can use the bolts from a harmonic balancer puller, and then you'll need some extra washers to make sure that uh, you don't put the bolts too far through the balancer. And then a drill with a one and a quarter inch wood bit and a three eighths inch bit, as well as you obviously need the torque wrench and 22 millimeter socket with an extension. Okay, it's time to tighten the harmonic balancer. Uh, and here is my special tool. It's two by four, just over two feet long, with a large hole and two smaller holes. And I'm going to bolt it in and show you how it works. Okay, now you can see what I've done is I've taken my harmonic balancer puller bolts and bolted uh, the 2x4 to the harmonic balancer. This nice big hole is where I'm going to access uh, the bolt with an extension. Um, you want to, I've got a couple washers on here. You want to make sure that uh, the bolts go through and hold enough and they're tight, pulling the board tight against the pulley here, uh, but also that they're not coming through the back side and interfering. Okay, and then the board will hold itself against the frame there. Okay, two quick notes. Uh, the bolts I used to bolt the 2x4 on are the bolts from the harmonic balancer puller. And the other note is you can see that my timing mark is now way beyond the zero degree. You do need to turn your balancer um, so that the um, 2x4 can be bolted on there. There are some items at the bottom that will interfere with it. Uh, so you have to have it in this position in order to bolt the board on there. Okay, Torque wrench in there. Okay, now we just unbolt that and we're all set. And on this vehicle, that bolt should be torqued to 181 foot pounds. We hope this helps you out. Brought to you by www.1aauto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Please feel free to call us toll free 888-844-3393. We're the company that's here for you on the internet and in person.